Good morning. Welcome, God's people. You reached Waiting for the One, Grace Podcast, Scriptures Read Daily from New Living Translation Bible, along with daily greetings, requests for happy birthdays, births, anniversaries, other prayer requests, poems, and more. Let us begin with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. God, let your word resonate and penetrate in us and give us faith, love, hope, health, wisdom, strength, and all we need for today. Amen. Psalm 91 is a protection prayer that the recommendation is reading or hearing it one to two times daily. The first scripture of the day is 1 Corinthians 13, 4 to 5. Love is patient and kind. Love is not jealous or boastful or proud or rude. It does not demand its own way. It is not irritable and it keeps no record of being wronged. The next scripture is Galatians 5, 26. Let us not become conceited or provoke one another or be jealous of one another. The next scripture is 2 Timothy 2.15. Work hard so you can present yourself to God and receive his approval. Be a good worker, one who does not need to be ashamed and who correctly explains the word of truth. The next scripture is Titus 2.15. You must teach these things and encourage the believers to do them. You have the authority to correct them when necessary, so don't let anyone disregard what you say. The next scripture is Hebrews 4.16. So let us come boldly to the throne of our gracious God. There we will receive his mercy and we will find grace to help us when we need it most. The next scripture is James 3.14. But if you are bitterly jealous and there is selfish ambition in your heart, don't cover up the truth with boasting and lying. The next scripture is James 4, 6, and it is the last scripture of the day. But he gives us even more grace to stand against such evil desires. As the scriptures say, God opposes the proud, but favors the humble. Now we have extra suggestive reading. 1 Corinthians 13, 1 to 13. Galatians 5, 1 to 26. 2 Timothy 2, 1 to 26. Titus 2, 1 to 15. Hebrews 4, 1 to 16. James 3, 1 to 18. James 4, 1 to 17. Today's category is a poem, and the title is A Loved One's Goodbye. It is found on part two of the same title of this episode. Today we have one wedding anniversary request. Happy anniversary to Gus and Eva. Have a God-blessed wedding anniversary today and always. And that message is from Fernando and Lori. We also have a anniversary prayer for Gus and Eva. Let us begin with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless Gus and Eva on their wedding anniversary. Let their love for each other increase and let them confirm and accept you, Jesus, as the glue 
that keeps them sticking together for all the days of their lives. We ask this through Jesus' broken body and through Jesus' bloodshed. In Christ Jesus' name, amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, amen. Thank you for listening in and joining in with us. We look forward to you listening in tomorrow. Tomorrow's category is imagery response. The title is Jesus' is Calling. This episode is very important. Birthdays, occasional prayers, requests can be left at wishingwell142 at gmail.com. The two W's are capitalized and the remaining letters are lowercase. Come and join our prayer team. Pray from your own home. Email wishingwell142 at gmail.com. Attention WFTO dash prayer team slash prayer warrior dash join. Have a God-blessed, miraculous Monday for yourselves and your families. Amen.